Let's start off with taking a look at the new April Fool's Show promo that will be dropping tomorrow in NBA Live Mobile Season 6. All of the screenshots we're about to take a look at are on EA's live stream on Twitch. The link to that will be in the description down below. You can go check it out. But as you can see over here, we'll start with the promo, then we'll go on to the live pass, and then finally we'll take a look at the monthly master section. We've got a bunch of stuff to go through, so let's start off with this promo. You can see there are five 96 overall masters. You've got Elgin Baylor, you've got Magic Johnson, you've got Joel Embiid, you've got Russell Westbrook, and you've got Kevin. Kevin Garnett all giving out boosts which is really really good over here you got a good mixture of players um, all from different positions as you can see it says the April Fool Show welcome to the April Fool Show collect the April Fool Show tokens to a 96 overall April Fool Show Masters collect all five Masters and trade them in to receive a 98 overall Grandmaster Shaquille O'Neal and all of your Masters back so it has got a sort of theme to do with uh, Shaq Tina Fool obviously I think it's on NBA TNT um, or something like that on ESPN um, but it is pretty good it is pretty fun obviously you can watch the clips on youtube i tried to do something similar with nba live mobile but it is based on that and of course april fool's day hopefully all of this stuff is actually coming to the game i'm guessing it will be obviously it's hopefully not an april fool's prank but all of these guys are looking pretty good we'll take a quick look at some of their stats if you want to pause the video at any point to take a more in-depth look you can by all means do that you can see your old school edition master elgin baylor at that power small forward position he is giving it a gold playmaking boost out which is looking pretty nice he's got a 99 mid-range shot and a 96 three-point shot looking very nice over there and a 94 layup and then on the defensive end looking decent as well on the left hand side you've got an 88 block and a 67 still playmaking stats aren't the best but i'm guessing he's mainly more of a shooter with some of those shooting stats then going on to your magic johnson card he is a finesse shooting guard giving out that gold post defense boost and he is the april fool's show special guest master over there he's got some nice stats as well he's got a 92 speed a 92 dribbling an 86 mid-range shot and an 87 three-point shot obviously a magic card doesn't always have the best shooting stats but he is very tough to come up against on the AI sort of side. And he's got a 74 block and a 93 still playmaking side looking very nice for a Magic Johnson card over there. And he's at the shooting guard position instead of that point guard position which we had earlier on in the season. Then you've got Joel Embiid giving out another gold playmaking boost. He has a finesse center card over here. He's got some very nice dunking stats with a 98 dunking, 93 layup, a 90 offensive rebounding and an 89 defensive rebounding. So a little bit low on those sort of stats, but a 91 three-point shot for a center and a 93 mid-range shot both of those stats for a center card are looking pretty good over there as well and on the defensive end looking pretty decent not the best though compared to some of the other center cards that we have got though he is focusing more on the shooting stats and the playmaking stats aren't that good considering he is giving out that playmaking boost but he has got a 97 block as well which is looking pretty good then you got russell westbrook he is giving out a gold post defensive boost he is a strategic point guard and he is your most valuable master obviously if you watch acting a full lot you guys will know that he appears quite a lot of the time on Shaq in the full but as you can see his stats he's got a 97 speed a 92 offensive rebounding and 93 defensive rebounding 97 dunking 89 layup 98 mid-range shot and an 87 three-point shot he's looking like a very very nice point guard over here maybe one to try and get out of all the masters he's got a 71 block and an 86 still playmaking stats are pretty good with a 95 court vision and a 91 passing accuracy so overall a pretty nice card then Kevin Garnett the one I think a lot of people will go for probably with this master he is your show cast master and he's giving out that gold athleticism boost which is the best boost you can get in the game he is a strategic power forward over here he's got a 93 dunking a 97 layup 92 offensive rebounding 93 defensive rebounding 93 throw 96 mid-range shot and a 93 three-point shot for a power forward card these are really, really good stats over here. On the left-hand side, on the defensive end, he is looking very nice as well. Most of those stats in the high 80s, low 90s. He's got 78 block and an 80 still. Playmaking side, not the best, but he has got that good defensive side and good shooting stats and good rebounding stats as well. So he's probably one of the masters to maybe go for. It's probably between him and Russell Westbrook looking at their sort of stats. And obviously this one stands out because he is giving out that gold athleticism boost, which is super valuable when it comes to it. Now we have got a completely new map. It's not a completely new promo format. It is one that we have had before. I think it was the Harvest promo, but they have made quite a few tweaks, which will be pretty interesting when we go ahead and actually play through this promo. But it is a completely new map. It's looking pretty nice over here. You got your five different sections. As you can see, you'll play through and you'll get yourself some guaranteed tokens and a chance of getting some extra tokens. There's a special star event over here, which is basically 
basically your blitz event and you do have two tokens of your choice and a chance of getting an 89 to 93 overall player which will really help you in the sets if you manage to get one of these players you then we'll go on to the sets later on in the video and i will take a quick look at some of the actual events themselves so the promo is up for seven days in total so they have sort of adjusted it a little bit to make up for that so instead of having three tokens in these events you can see you've got four tokens and a 50 percent chance of getting some extra tokens as well which is going to be very useful and all of these events will unlock at different times you can see this one is going to reset at 8 a.m est and the rest of them will reset throughout the whole day as it were which is pretty good but it's nice to see they're looking at these promo formats and thinking what can we improve what can we change about it and that is looking pretty nice over here so that's one change that they made you can see the special event over here is going to give you some extra stuff so this one can be done once every single day the other one can be done more than once i think it's about five times every single day no it's only twice over there so you can do this one twice this one is only done once every single day it's going to give you three of the specific tokens and a 10 percent chance at getting one of the players you can see there's a vip event pass over here as well and then obviously this is sort of a summary so you'll get your tokens you'll trade them in for your 96 overall masters and low overall masters and then you're trading those to be able to get yourself that 98 shaquille o'neal now we'll take a look at some of the sets over here and then we'll go on to what they have changed with this so obviously for the different masters you're going to need the low overall players so you're going to need the 89 90 91 92 and 93 overall versions of all the players to be able to get yourself your 96 overall master as it were so we'll take a look at some of them these are where your tokens are being used so for the casting sort of master in kevin garnett you're going to need to get uh, this kenny smith who is also from the shacks in the full sort of panel of um, hosts on that show you've also got steve smith over here he's a 90 overall and obviously as you keep going up and overall the more tokens you're going to require you need 45 tokens for a dennis scott you need 65 tokens for a lamar odom and you need 90 tokens for your chris weber over here who is your 93 grandmaster get all of these guys and you will get yourself that 96 overall kevin garnett now what they have changed is they've taken off 30 tokens from the master set so it used to be 280 in total i think it was now it is 250 so they have made that reduction they've also added to token exchange which we'll go on to later and they've made it so there is no escalation at all so this is what you're going to get throughout the whole promo it's going to stick like this and we'll go on to what you can get now when you spent exactly the same stuff for westbrook just with different players you got otto porter jr you've got demarcus cousins you got kendrick perkins you got dwight howard over here you got blake griffin and then joel and bead exactly the same stuff we're just sort of going to whiz through these ones a little bit over here then again Again, Magic Johnson, exactly the same stuff, but he's interesting because he has got different versions of himself instead of different players over here. And then you've got your Elgin Baylor as well, a load of different players. You can try and get all with very similar structures in how you're trying to get them. Your Grandmaster Shaquille O'Neal trading all five to be able to get him at Playstyle Select. We don't have any stats for him, unfortunately, though we do have a rough idea as to what boost he's giving out and Playstyle and all of that stuff. Um, obviously, he has Playstyle Select over there. They did add this extra token exchange, so 25 random tokens gets yourself a 15 token select pack where you can pick exactly which tokens you need to be able to get yourself the masters you want and then there's also the 10 for the five and there's also the two for the one so they added that extra token exchange to help you just get through it a little bit quicker which is pretty good it saves you having to do a bunch of sets multiple times now you can see Shaq over here is at that point guard position which is really really interesting he's not at the center position kind of sticking with the april fools theme he is at that point guard position he's giving out that gold i think is a strength boost or it used to be a bully ball boost i don't exactly know what it is right now but he is at that point guard position and he does have a dunk package so Shaq at a point guard position with that dunk package is just going to be absolutely crazy now you won't get him unfortunately no money spent the most you could probably get the guys worked it out um I think it's mainly the EA developers worked this out um you're probably going to get no money spent three masters if you play all the events and if you get lucky but that's obviously dependent on how much luck you get with this promo you're probably going to get two maybe guaranteed maybe one guaranteed and then two if you're lucky and then three if you play all the events and you are lucky but that's what some of the guys worked out obviously we'll have to wait and see exactly what happens with this promo when it all drops tomorrow so make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on so you don't miss my promo breakdown where i'm going to tell you how you can get these guys super quickly so that is your april fools show promo over there it's looking very nice and very interesting to see but now let's take a look at the life pass which a lot of people are interested in and it's exactly the same stuff as last time in that the mvp stuff and the premium stuff is completely separate you can't buy both you can only buy one or the other you've got some very nice players though so let's take a look at it. you've got some bonus he's giving out an elite shooting boost which is very nice to see it's our first players with elite 
sort of boost on them. You've got Jimmy Butler, 100 overall, giving out an elite athleticism boost. So this is maybe one you want to try and spend the money and try and get if you are pay to win over here. You've also got a Storm Master of the Paul George for the MVP section. He's got no boost, but he has 97 overall. You've got a Pascal Siakam over here. He's 96 overall, giving out a gold rebounding boost. That's sort of separating the MVP and the premium one with the MVP one giving out elite boost. This one giving out the gold boost and the normal one not giving boost at all. You've got the Mar Derosian, again, 100 overall playstyle select, giving out that gold inside scoring boost. And then you can see him over here. We'll take a look at some of his stats later. Then you've got your general one, your free to play one. You've got a 96 overall DeJounte Murray. Hopefully I'm saying that right, but he isn't giving out a boost. And that's where it separates the different tiers, as it were, of how much money you are willing to spend. The Mar stats over here, you can take a quick look at them. He is giving out that inside scoring boost. He is playstyle select and he is at that small four position. Jump out stats are that 96 mirror range shot and the 95 speed and 96 agility as well as that 99 layup and 94 dunking defensive end looking pretty good with that 92 block and 91 steal and then your grandmaster as it were for the whole thing jimmy butler you can only get these guys by spending money he's giving out that elite athleticism boost and that elite coin boost which is looking really really nice 100 dunking and 100 scoring with contact looking absolutely crazy and then on the defensive end looking pretty good as well most of those stats in the high 80s low 90s and then playmaking stats wise absolutely nuts 95 passing accuracy 94 court vision and a 100 interception looking very nice and then finally onto your monthly master section stuff it is exactly the same as last time unfortunately no changes there at all i was hoping they might go up to the events and all of that stuff as it was um a couple months ago they added it on february i think towards the end of that month but unfortunately they're not going to do that you've got your grandmasters you've got 98 bogdanovich you've got gervin and you've got haywood over here all 98 overall exactly the same stuff i'm just going to quickly whiz through their stats is at a power center position all of your monthly master emblems and your life pass points as it were won't reset the life pass tickets will reset though um so that should be the case with that i don't know exactly how finalized these stats are but he has got a 97 dunking and a 93 layup rebounding stats looking pretty good at a 96 and 95 defense Defensive end again looking very nice in the low 90s on the left hand side and that 93 block then you've got George Gervin over here he is at that strategic small forward position a 100 strength 99 dunking 89 layup 99 mid-range shot is looking very nice over there 89 block and an 89 still and Nick did mention that these stats aren't finalized he doesn't know that for certain so we are gonna have to wait and see when they drop in the game you got Spencer Hayward over here at that finesse powerful position 89 dunking and a 95 mid-range shot and an 89 three-point shot and then your this date player is a 93 overall Joe Dumas. He is giving out a plus two defensive boost on him and he's your this date player. I don't know exactly when he's going to drop uh, with this actual promo, but he will drop throughout the whole month. But there is no change really with the monthly master section. We also got a little bit of a sneak peek for a side promo that should be dropping. I think we'll get sneak peeks for it on the weekend, but it is a five day promo. It's not a seven day promo um, like we had last time or a nine day promo. This main promo is out for seven days and the side promo will be out for five days. It's looking like it's called Musical Stars and it's going to be interesting to see exactly what that is and what that entails with that promo. That is all that we got. We got the promo, we've got the monthly masters, we got the live pass and it is looking very nice in the month of March. It is looking good in the fact that they are looking to improve the promo formats that we have got before. And hopefully, fingers crossed, they do make some future changes to promo formats and also making completely new ones because I think that's something we all want to see. A quick update on the auction house. Hopefully, there will be a fix in the next couple of days. Nick did mention that. And trade upsets are coming soon, um, which is going to be interesting to see. I will have a couple of videos out on the channel. Firstly, tomorrow, explaining how you can get these masters completely free and really quickly. And also, I'm looking to make another coin making method video for all of you guys struggling to make coins because I managed to make a bunch of coins. So I'm going to hopefully uh, share that with you guys and how you can make the coins but that's going to be it for the video if you did enjoy it and you did find it helpful go to drop a like on the video and comment down below what are you most excited for with the new promo what are you most excited for with the monthly master the live pass all of this stuff let me know in the comment section down below and i'll see you guys in the next one peace